Morning guys. <laughs> uh, oof. I'm a mess. My lighting is so weird guys. Uh, this is the one day <laughs> where there's actually sun. It's been raining the whole week and I don't know what's going on with my camera. Like she's really dizzy. I look orange. Like I legit look orange. Oh am I overreacting? You know what whatever but morning guys how are you it's morning actually uh i hardly <laughs> am up at this time uh but you know what not, i'm not hardly up at this time just being dramatic but it's more of like i know i'm gonna be productive if i'm gonna be up this time so before i start my day i'm just going to i've been starting here from amanda hair amanda amanda hair <laughs> Uh, before I start my day and they sent me this beautiful unit that's 22 inches long and inside the box I got some wig caps but you know what I don't want to waste my wig caps I'm gonna use a wig cap that's already here but they sent me this nice curly unit Oh, she pretty or whatever. Oh, well, this hair is a Brazilian curly. Let me show you. It's so beautiful. Period. Poo. I hope you guys can see it. Uh, this is a Brazilian curly. And it's a 13 by 4 lace. Let me just show you inside. It's a 13 by 4 lace. And this is apparently virgin Brazilian hair. And the density is 180. Uh, I agree. I agree. I agree. She thick. <laughs> uh, I should have bleached the knot, but I actually can uh, just put some foundation for now, to be honest. Like, I don't really have to bleach the knots. I just put on some powder and foundation on the lace i think i'm gonna bleach it tonight and i'll wear the wig again tomorrow and you guys will see how it looks but um this is the inside it's standard uh the quality of the make the construction i mean is good so nothing is hanging no threads are hanging so that's a good sign because nothing is going to unravel your tracks are not gonna fall out uh it has the standard combs i think there's four if not five and it also has these adjustable strips these guys they are believe i was into literally my wig depends on this these are the only things that i use for my wig and i also want you to get into the curl pattern quickly get into it again she cute or whatever i'm really lazy to style my hair especially when it's cold because i feel like they are cold dollar but once it starts getting warm little <laughs> kakana yeah, that like guys. <laughs> mm, also, I just want my hair to grow just like a few inches longer. So, uh, I just also want to put in some clip-ins 
just to give it body and volume uh and then look like an as i said Your ear tabs are usually stubborn, to be honest, because uh, I don't know why, to be honest, but they're usually stubborn, and I'm not the only one who thinks they are. So I'll usually go in with this glue, or if I want my ear tabs to be like laid. I'm feeling this hair, Luna. Let me put some mousse. Y'all know I buy for her. Show me anything cuter than this hair. Especially now that springtime is coming. I know it's a bit far, but it's actually coming. It's like really, it's here. <laughs> it's a few weeks. Spring is in a few weeks, guys. It's in a month. So. <laughs> It's not in a month, guys. I'm being dramatic, but like spring is here. For me, after it hits July, it's spring chill. But it's gonna get warmer. So if you wanna look cute, the festive season, most of us are gonna be vaccinated. Because they cute. You know, because they cute. Um, you know what, guys? Let me go. My husband is calling me. He's at the park with the kids. And. Uh, let me just go so we can I think I'm, we're gonna go get lunch but I do because he's cute I didn't kind of say any lace she looks really good 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 guys let me make my kids food and stop admiring myself Anyway, guys, I'm gonna go bleach my knots and then get the kids ready for bed. And then I'll see you guys tomorrow. Guys, you know what? No? Let me be an adult. <laughs> Before I go upstairs to go bleach my knots and do all the things I have to do with taking care of myself. Let me um, 
let me let me say let me separate my meat um i don't know if i mentioned this but um i usually uh separate my meat or my chicken pieces and my sausage pieces in these small bags but these are reusable freezer bags from Woolies. I'm sure you can get bigger ones. These ones are small because we're a small family. I don't need huge ones. But these are really good. I used to just buy the normal packets from Westpac. But the pumps that they used to stick on each other. So like when I was trying to get the meat from the freezer, it would just like stick on each other. So it would be admin that I didn't need. So with these ones, they don't stick on each other. You can literally just pull it out of the freezer and nothing will be stuck on anything. So they are reusable, so you can wash them and you can use them as many times as you can. So yeah, I just want to show you these guys. So let me just get the meat, section the meat, uh, sorry, <laughs> uh, portion the meat and then I have to fold some laundry. I don't want to be lazy because I don't want to wake up tomorrow and have things to do then I'm not able to fully vlog. So I'm going to fold the laundry because it needs to go to the dry cleaner to go get ironed. So you know what, let me, let me be an adult. <laughs> Guys, I'm sure this wig hates me. I've left it on for I've left the the bleach on for so long. But I'm going to be using this neutralizer shampoo from Dark and Lovely. Then let me show you what I do. I make a fake purple shampoo. Uh, I'll show you what I do.
<laughs> guys I'm so tired I'm done I'm going to relax and enjoy myself here's my food here's my drink and I'm just going to Yolala Mook and tired I have words to my lost bone so uh, good night guys I'll see you tomorrow morning guys <laughs> What's on the agenda today? I look so crusty. Morning. I woke up so early in the morning. I'm being very productive today. Uh, let me see. What's on the agenda today? I already done my makeup, which is something that I needed to do. I am planning to shoot another reels. I'm trying to give this Instagram content because I feel like Instagram is one of uh, my platforms that I like i do obviously pay attention to detail but it's more like i don't give in as much as i usually do on youtube as much as i've been mia on youtube uh I, I was trying to sort out some stuff sorry i was trying to sort out some stuff but everything is sorted now everything's good uh i'm great back at work um what else do i need to do i also want to bake some like banana bread because i have bananas that are literally rotting they have been rotting for the longest time as much as i don't eat bananas uh, i think my family and my husband my kids will appreciate it so that's what we're doing and the reason why i'm sitting here today I will, oh the reason why i'm sitting here today is because uh I'm, i want to put on this wig again with you guys i don't know why i'm just I'm feeling I'm feeling like doing it but I just want to show you the wig this is the wig I bleached the knots yesterday yesterday I ended up bleaching so many wigs <laughs> crazy like um, this is how it looks with the knots bleached I don't know I, I don't feel like the knots are bleached to full potential but I can live with it so um, what I want to do before putting on the wig i want to just put some foundation i still do put foundation after bleaching the knots and some maybe tongue to um some powder so i'm gonna use this revlon foundation stick that i sometimes use as like a bronzer like a contour bronzer because it's too it's too warm for me to use it as a as a contour so sometimes I like I act like it's a bronzer if that makes sense but I'm just going to put some foundation on the lace again oh guys I'm actually in love with this wig I'm giving it so much attention usually I don't do this to wigs but girl you are getting extra attention she's loved one thing about me I love a curly wig guys one thing about me I feel like straight hair doesn't look nice on me. I don't know why. And I used to wear, okay, but like it was not really straight. It was like, it used to be like layered. There's this one wig of mine that I had and the hair was a top Shayla quality. Like it was, the quality was so good of that hair. Um, I used to wear it all the damn time. Uh, it was not really straight like i'd wear it straight but like i would make it like bouncy if that makes sense like yeah i would make it like that and mm, i love that wig but now i think i'm grown i'm a grown woman where are my earrings uh, i want to do a reels guys and I also just want to do the unboxing. Like I have so many things that I want to show you. I've some I've got I've got via PR and some I've bought. I also want to show you like some stuff I got from Zara. Actually, I didn't get some stuff from Zara. I got a lot of stuff for my kids, but not for me. But I actually just wanted to show you some like I got two items from Zara. Uh, one on the sale and one that was not on the sale. Cause what it's doing just look at it uh actually you know what before i do anything uh i'm i'm thinking of just using a hot comb just to flatten the front and then i'll stick it on or maybe let me just stick it on first and then
guys, I'm sitting here because there's <laughs> some sun and basically in the water is longer. <laughs> but I'm just going to. I really hate styling my hair on my hair on my hair, on my head because I don't want to burn myself. One thing I don't like is I don't want to burn myself. I'm not in the business of burning myself. Luna, like when I take you for long, ma, huh? Like boner. Yo, I shame. They really did the do. They did the do here. I'm under hair. They promised I'm Dabao. Did a great job. Love this hair. If you want to shop this hair, please don't forget to check out Amanda Hair. And everything that has to do with the hair will be in the description box down below. Um, I think let me unbox these goodies for you guys and just show you the stuff that I have. And then uh, I think I'm gonna go shoot my reels. And then we're gonna go bake and make some food. I'm back guys, I wore my earrings. I'm feeling so cute. Can someone take me out on a date? <laughs> um, what am I starting with? Actually, let me go grab a scissor. Let me just get a scissor so I can cut these packages. I don't know where to start. <laughs> Oh, okay, let's just start here because I've already worn these. So I got a package, a press drop from Uggs. How cute. Uh, inside the box, it was, it had these cute, it has, it had this cute pink tissue. I don't know what to call it. The shoes were, had these inside, so like just to, to structure them. And then, this is the, I don't know if you guys can see it. Um, maybe because it's trying to, yeah, there. I don't know if you guys can see it. And um, I, let me just show you the eggs quickly. I've been wearing them, like I think yesterday I wore them. Uh, I've been wearing them as like house shoes, but um, let me just show you. These are the ones that I got. I got these ones. Uh, initially, I wanted to get some pink ones, but they were out of stock. And I I asked the lady to choose between this one and these green ones. I don't know if you can see them. But yeah, these, uh, they're called pollen. Uh, but I ended up choosing these ones because I feel like these ones were safe and uh, if I want to take a picture, they would suit the aesthetic of my Instagram and they're cute. Uh, they're very comfortable and they're also very hard. So they're not going to, uh, I, 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 I don't Yeah. Like they're not going to lose shape quickly. This is how, this is so cute. I think this detail here is extremely cute. Uh, they written ads inside and uh they are true to size because i'm a size four and i asked for 37 and they are true to size they're not big nor are they small um what else um, yeah but these are really cute guys they're so cute uh love them uh what did i also get in here i also got i can finally wear these socks i didn't want to wear them before i show you guys but i got these really they're so mushy like i need to wear them like right now i want to wear them right now but they're from a brand called Cozy. I think uh, the brand is a South African brand based in Cape Town, if that makes If I'm correct, if I'm correct. Uh, happy, love, love these shoes. I've been wearing them everywhere. They're also warm. Um, what else? Okay, let me show you what I got from Zara. So from the Zara sale, I got this pinstriped silk blue shirt. I got it in a small, guys, because... Um, this was the only size and as you can see it has the square that represents that it's true to size so uh it's it's supposed to be a oversized shirt but i don't think it's going to be an oversized shirt on me because i obviously got a small and i really wanted this shirt guys there were two options there was another one but the other one was i don't know i didn't it didn't pop and look as 
expensive as this one so i took this one i've been on the look out for a blue silk shirt and this is a staple in my wardrobe i've had I've, i had one that i bought from mr price years ago but yeah i pay luck guys so this is where we at right now love it and this looks fairly like the quality looks good except uh from the <laughs> from the <laughs> from the threads that are hanging out which is like true to zara it's fast fashion at the end of the day but it looks like it's a shirt that will last me a long time i don't think it's a shirt that's going to be messed up anytime soon and in terms of fit it fits very much like like the nude one that i bought in my last zara haul but um I'm not mad guys, the shirt is a shirt I love but enough shirts, they are big staple in my wardrobe and um, yeah I think this was a good buy. I don't know what happened to the price but I think I bought it for like 3 something coming from 7 if not 8 something and then the week before I went to Zara and I bought this chair. Uh, I was stuck between the leather blazer that everyone has and this one and let me tell you something um <laughs> i don't know what to say but i've been looking for a tweed piece for the longest time and i've seen it in like these instagram boutiques and china mall to be specific but uh, and also she in has but I wasn't convinced, like it didn't look the part. They looked nice, but they didn't look the part. And I knew that if I'm gonna buy something from an Instagram boutique or China mall, it's not gonna last that long. Uh, this one looks, the quality is is better, honestly. The quality is better. And uh, I don't know, guys, like, I, I feel like I, I've never been as happy as I am when it comes to purchasing something like this. I am so happy about this. I've been looking for a black blazer for the longest time and <laughs> darling, this is giving me lady of affluence. It's giving me high quality love. The structure of the blazer, manyeke, perfecto. Anything that is nice is the blazer. And I got the blazer in size medium uh and because guys the reason i got this one in a size medium because my nude blazer that's like longer is in a size it's in a size large and like oh she's a bit big it fits but it's also just a bit big like it, it doesn't hug me the way i want it to hug me so um this and it has the little slit at the back <laughs> uh it has a little slit at the back so it's gonna do the things for me it's cinched in there's dots on the side it's cinched in the pockets are completely fake oh they just need to be i think the pockets are fake i don't think the pockets are real and um it's the gold detail for me it's the gold hardware for me period period and then it's this for me it's double breasted has a very thick lapel she is cute inside the lining is normal lining love this blazer i got this blazer for 1400 one 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 three nine nine if you can see this initially i thought i went to the zara sale thinking that it's going to be on sale and i was like if it's on sale i'm returning it and getting the same blazer but on sale price if that makes sense but it wasn't on sale uh, when I went to Zara, it wasn't on sale, sadly, <laughs> and um, I just have to keep it, but I'm sad that I had to, it wasn't on sale, like, <laughs> I would have loved to save, save the back. Uh, then, I'm looking for a scissor, that's why I'm, oh, my god, I went to dig up, guys, also, like, I'm so distracted, but anyway, I also got a press drop from... <laughs> I don't know if you guys know but if you follow me on instagram i recently worked at duck and lovely and working with duck and lovely was literally one of my dreams anyone that knows me like anyone that spends time with me knows how much i've been trying to work with duck and Lo not trying to work but like manifesting working with duck and lovely anything so uh after that i think 
hair companies saw me and they saw what I do. And RS, since it's one of the brands that I literally write for, especially when it comes to hair care and my own hair, they also sent me a press drop. And um, I can't wait to show you what's inside. I haven't seen what's inside. Oh, guys, I hope you guys didn't see my dress. But, um,. I don't know what's inside uh, hopefully there is sufficient mousse uh, so I don't have to go buy more and then let's just check what's inside I really want to change and wear something warm but my jersey is here we have had it's starting to get cold uh, let me just try open this guys I'm so excited like it's actually a nicely packed A nicely packed package. Oh my god! I'm literally out here working with brands I've been trying to work with for the longest time. Guys, what's in here? Um, black castor oil. Come on, go away, please. Hamba, papa, hamba. Go, darling. I want to see there's something that I'll show you what's inside guys but I just I just want to see what's this what is this what is it it looks like a weapon how do you open it so let me just check what's in here uh, so they gave me this love it love it <laughs> i use this so much guys uh i have my own i've been using this forever so uh i also love this so much uh? go papa go pick is so annoying guys I got this. Okay, Baba. And I also got this re replenishing conditioner. Love. This I have I have to try. I've never I've never tried this. What else did they give me? I also got this conditioning hair styling gel. Love it. Love. I wish I could show you also the stuff that I got from Dark and Lovely. But girl, I'm lazy. But um I love these. Uh, in here, let me just sh post this on my stories, and then I'll I'll open this thing. The box is really cute. So they have. I think this is a new range, but I think it's a uh, oh castor oil infused. range uh they have a braid spray and uh hair oil i'm definitely gonna be using this because i have fine hair and with my fine hair i really just wanna thicken my hair if that makes sense even though i'm relaxing my hair which personally i know that my hair thrives better when it's relaxed versus when it's not relaxed if that makes sense uh, also I'm very tender headed so having my hair natural doesn't help me in any sort so <laughs> um, I'm going to be using these and they also gave me a scalp balm oh this Utasu thing oh, I'm excited for this and uh, what's this Scalp and braid cleansing dry. Oh, so this is a dry shampoo for black girls. Period. Period. Wow, guys. Guys, I'm never interested. It's a dry shampoo for brown skinned girls. <laughs> so I deserve. Yes, guys, that's just deserve. It is nice. Wow, I like this. So I went to coach and I got the bag, which I'll show you now. But within the bag, I also got a wallet, guys, because um, it was part of the gift that I got uh, for buying the bag, whatever. So I got a little wallet that came in this 
nice cute coach paper bag and uh, it came in this box and it also has a little dust bag initially I took a pink one I don't know why guys I don't know why I took a pink one but I was like no no ways I'm not gonna be carrying a pink one it's like it doesn't make sense I'm not that girl uh, and I went to go change it for the black this is just a card holder nothing serious nothing special and guys <laughs> Uh, this is the wallet. It's a black card holder. Literally nothing special. Also, like, I'm not a wallet girl. Enyan swim. But anyway, it's so weird, guys. You know how much I... One thing, one thing about me. I used to... I don't know where I am, but I used to hate... There are three brands that I can't stand. I think there are two, actually, not three. It's Michael Kors. Michael Kors. There are two brands that I can't stand. It's Michael Kors and coach cannot i knew like for sure I, what i was not buying from those brands i wasn't even going into uh into the thing into the stores you would never not even even when the coach store opened in johannesburg saw that even the michael Kors store when it opened in johannesburg didn't even slip a foot inside i know how it looks from the outside i've never been inside because i was just like these are brands that i don't like like i I'm just not into them like that. I don't know why. I know why, obviously. Uh, but there were just brands that I didn't like, if that makes sense. But <laughs> Coach is like, baby girl, uh, we're going to give you something in 2020. Was it 2020 or 21? But whatever it is. And they gave. Uh, so they gave us. They gave us the Coach Tibby pillow or pillow tebby i got mine in the 26 which is like i think it's medium or it's the biggest one there's also a mini that looks extremely cute but it didn't make sense for me like i'm not a girl like i would buy a mini bag but i was not looking for a mini bag and i was also looking for a white bag because i have two brown bags okay i don't count guys i actually don't count my never full as a bag bag uh so i have a brown bag I, so I was looking for a white bag and I'm also going to look into getting a black bag. I'll either get a black bag. I think I'm going to get, I'm not sure, but um, I'm looking into, I'll probably, guys, I'll probably get a Gucci bag. Also Gucci, guys, is one of those brands that I can't love, especially when it comes to, um, especially when it comes to bags. I, so, but I'm also looking for a black bag and I'm not rushing myself at all. Like, I'm, I'm not impulsive. When it comes to fashion, guys, please don't be impulsive. Be like me. Buy things at your own time. Uh, don't feel pressured to buy stuff when, because everyone is buying it. So, but, <laughs> when it comes to this bag, I saw this bag on Melissa, Melissa's page and I was like, girl, I need to get that bag. And, you know, when people are buying it, I was like, mm, guys, I don't want to fall for this hype. I don't want to fall for this hype because I don't like this brand. And <laughs> Coach really changed my mind. I'm in love. This is how the bag came. It came in this dust bag. And ah, uh, guys, the best purchase of the decade. <laughs> this is the Coach. I hope you guys can see it. Tabby pillow 26 uh, I didn't like a, a close-up what you call it a close-up unboxing on my Instagram reels you can go check it out but but I'm so happy guys uh, it has a little tag that's written coach I hope you guys can see it oh this bag is perfect guys Wow love the yeah the tanda you know guys i love this bag so much that i actually don't want to use it like i actually don't want to use it and if you want to see how it opens it opens like this and uh it has two straps so there is a shoulder strap like i don't know if i'm that girl who carries her bags like that but uh it seems like it's the end thing um i'm not pressured to but i mean this is what the bag comes with it's a shoulder strap um 
it's cute it's really small it's also like very foamy and very squishy and uh, the hardware is top notch love it it's like a brass gold it's not a shiny gold like how my push it matisse was it's like a brassy gold and the details were coach like everywhere by the coach guys ah love it it also has a brown glazing just like my push it matisse Woo! this bag guys this i love you know what this is why i never push it to buy luxury items when like when everyone is buying it because i want to buy something that i really love like like my push my push it matisse i love it and um yeah man i love this bag so much like i highly recommend this bag in every color except black i didn't like the black one it didn't look nice but all the other colors looks good uh this is the longer strap It also has the details where it's written coach. And this is more of like my strap. You can wear it cross body. Uh, you can, it's just longer and it's not as short as that other one. And this is the bag. So I feel like this bag, you can also wear it as a clutch if you don't want to carry it. It's so versatile guys. The versatility that comes with this bag, child. If you don't want to put a strap on it, you can literally carry it like this and it can be a clutch. And I think especially in summer, when you're going to places like weddings, like day weddings, even night. But I don't know if I'll wear it at night. I probably would actually. Uh, like a day wedding and you don't want to have a bag, but you have, want to have a clutch. This, cute. Like, this is really cute. Uh, it's, also, it's very squishy, guys. It's so soft. Uh, the leather is very premium like it's actual leather like it's actual leather and this is the inside of the bag so it has two compartments and a zip here oh, baby like the detail the tiny zip is also written coach this is written coach wait wait like please look one thing about me get okay, the attention to detail and this this is attention to detail at its best uh, Wow, and it also has this like brown thing written coach. I don't know. This is a little story. I think this is a coach bag Yeah, and I think it also has a, a Like a serial number or something like that uh, Love this bag. The only worry I have honestly I have with this bag. I'm I'm just worried as to will it be foamy forever uh, I haven't done research as to what did they use to make it foamy, but like I'm scared by is our part is our like it la it la pancha and it will deflate <laughs> like let me just use English but I'm just worried that it will deflate and it will look weird but I don't know like it's just so weird I'm not hundred percent sure but that's my only worry which guys I wish you could see his face go Samaya Piki. Fire. But that's the only issue I have. But more than anything, they also offer a they also offer a lifetime cleaning service. So if you ever got this bag dirty, you can take it to the coach store and they can clean it for you. I'm generally scared of making it dirty, but <laughs> for me, love this guys. If you if you're trying to buy this bag, and if you've been thinking of buying this bag, uh, please get it like please get it don't don't let this wave pass you like don't let the wave pass you so as i was saying guys if you are looking into buying this bag cop it and um if you're worried that it's sold out in the coach stores in south africa uh please check out my teresa or what is it is it far-fetched i'm so confused But you can either check on Farfetch or My Teresa, like you will get the bag. It's not gonna get lost. And also, I mean, this is a luxury bag that's more on the affordable side, <laughs> but that's also relative. But it's a beautiful bag. One thing I can say, if you are looking into getting it, get it. Like, go get it.
it's worth it like I haven't even used my bag but it's so precious I love it so much and I know that it's gonna work with a lot of things that I put it together with anyway I'm going to go um, I'm going to go shoot a reels with the bag so I'll see you guys let me let me just charge my battery and then uh, we'll make muffins I'm also gonna just change after doing my reels and just be warm and then we will I'll see you guys Guys, I ended up deciding on muffins. Why does this look so dodgy? <laughs> Weird. <laughs> but I decided on muffins. They are so full. I don't know if this is gonna end well, but <laughs> let's see. What I'm done with my banana cupcakes, guys. Uh, I think I'm gonna call it a night. Good night, guys. Good night, banana. Hey, baby. Uh, I'm literally so tired. <laughs> I'm very much tired. Uh, I think I am going to close off my vlog here. I have been vlogging. I have been working today. Chair. I did a lot. <laughs> Uh, but anyway, thank you for watching, guys. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. It's my birthday month. Let's get to 25k or whatever. Um, I'll see you guys. I'll see you. Thank you for watching. And I'll see you in my next vlog. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back like I never left. <laughs> but see you guys. <laughs>